beautiful children in the world, this is your Father in Heaven speaking through this maidservant on this day. My child, I see your struggles. I see your mental torment. I see all that is going on in your mind at this time. And I ask you to relax to hand all heavy burdens to me, to give unto me your whole self this day. Let go, my child. Let go of the worries and fears that concern you, the anxieties that are stealing your time. Place your hand in mine this day. Come on a spiritual adventure. Come experience my heavenly realm. Come, rejoice in your Saviour. Give unto him your time, your worship, your heart and your soul. I see myself being caught up in spirit and truth. I see myself before the Father. He is glorious in my sight. He smiles. My child, I want you to stand before me night and day. This is your ministry. This is your calling. To stand before me night and day in worship. Apart from this, Aleria Hashaka Kashikiti in releasing these words, Aleria Nahashikiti Kapoka Potorabasi. I want you to do nothing else but seek my face. Stand before me, my child. Lerebotorabasi Kia Hashikiti Kokarabasi. For this is when you will feel truly alive, truly at one with your Father in heaven. Father, there is so much to do on the earth. There are so many distractions that keep me from you. All I long for is to worship you, to be with you, to be standing before you in spirit and truth. My child, come here every day. Kalaharaba, come to this place before me. And I will give unto you my mysteries, so that you can reveal them on the earth for me. I want to show you new things, new and beautiful revelations for the world. I do not need you to be distracted at this time, my child. I commission you this day to stand before me in worship, to listen to my words, to receive my revelations, these visions, so that you can record them for the world. Holy Father, all I want and desire is to be with you. My heart longs to be with you night and day. And when we are apart, I long, my spirit longs to return to this place this beautiful place of worship. For it is here that I am free, just standing before you, seeking your face, loving you, adoring you, worshipping you. Oh, Lord, thank you for Haki, our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ, your Son. Thank you for the blessed Holy Spirit that lives within us. Thank you for your kingdom which is to come. My child, you are recording my mysteries for the world. The prophesied mysteries of God. You must stand before me until every word is declared. You must stand before your God. This is all I need you to do at this time. My Lord, there are so many things I feel which need to be done at this time. 
a little bottle of Asiki Anahashiki Tiki Anahash, so many things. My child, I command you to stand before me in worship. You need to center yourself before me night and day in worship, my child. There is nothing more, Haleriana, during this season that I need you to do. You must complete this task. You must declare every word as spoken to you during this season. You, Karahashi and the other maid servant who declares these words with you. Relax, rest. I will be in your waking thoughts. Allah ikiya la rabasi in every moment of your day. My child, there are so many visions I want to give you in the days to come. And I know how draining this can be on the physical flesh. You must guard your heart during this time. You must guard your strength. Kalaraba, just standing before me in worship is enough energy. Each day, my child, you have been trained for such a time as this. You know what to do. Keep your cup full. To be alert. To have more than enough energy to travel. Aleliana in spirit and truth. To see my face to stand before me in worship. I will energize you, my child, mentally, physically, spiritually, and emotionally. You will be content, at peace, at rest. I am breaking the chains of the world off you now. I see chains being released now from my wrists that are holding me to the earth so that I can soar in spirit and truth to my Father night and day. My child, I want you to walk in peace from this day forward. You now stand before me and me alone. I love you, my child. Come with me this day. Explain to the world all that you are seeing at this time. I see myself standing before you, Father. I see your hands in mine. I bow. On my knees I bow before you. I see your holy angel come beside me. He places his hand on my shoulder and I am filled with peace, with rest. I wish to stay here forever. This is the only place that I long to be. My child, a lot of Ahashikitiya, you are welcome. You are welcome to sit with me for eternity. You never have to leave. I do not want to leave. My Lord, my God, for being with you is where I am complete. I do not need to see other visions. I do not need to travel through the heavenly realms. I do not need to do a single other thing. I just wish to be with you. My child, I am so proud of you this day. For I have offered you all things. All things in your physical world and all things in your spiritual life. And you have chosen me above all things. My Lord, Alehan, I do not wish to return to the earth. I just wish to stay here with you. The world can be so distracting, taking up all of my time. 
so demanding, so controlling. My child, you have been trained. You know how to You know how to be with me in spirit and truth throughout every moment of your day. Now it is time to put all of that training into practice. Breathe me in, my child. Breathe me out. In and out. Oh Lord of Mahesh, I see the Father's arms wrapping around me. I feel so safe. Lord of so at peace. In my physical world, everything that is holding me to the earth falls away. The chains are broken. I am at complete peace. I am in his will. I have rest, complete rest in my soul. I see myself lying down in spirit before the Father. I see angels around me. They are praying. And it's like they are praying over my body over my soul. I see one angel holding my hand. I feel so happy here, Father. There is not a worry in the world. I feel so safe, so loved. I know you are taking care of me, taking care of my every need, and I thank you. I thank you for peace and rest this day. I thank you. I thank you for Jesus Christ. He has made a way. He has made a way for all of us to enter into your courts with praise and thanksgiving. The Holy Lamb. The Holy Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. Wash me clean this day, my Lord. Forgive me of my sins and have mercy on my sin. My child, you have entered my rest this day, and it is here you will stay. It is here you will stay, my child. I do not need for you to do a single other thing. Rest. Stay here in spirit and truth and rest. And the words will flow like oil, living water upon the earth, as you stand before me in spirit and truth. I am pouring forth my oil upon the earth, the golden glory, the golden oil, my words, my mysteries, you are releasing the oil. My two maidservants who stand before me night and day, you are releasing the mystery, my mystery. I see my friend, I see Karahalahara Hashiki, the other Karabas maidservant. We are servants of Christ called to release these words to the nation, called to write the mysteries of God. Thank you for your book. Thank you for your book which is being released unto the nations at this time. I pray people will come and read your words, your magnificent words written in spirit and truth, life-changing words, life-transforming, life-renewing words. I pray you will draw mankind to your book, Father, and then souls will be saved. People will go from glory to glory as they read your book. Thank you for these words. And thank you for the words we are releasing now. Thank you for the messages. 
1260 messages being released upon the earth at this time. Thank you. That we will finish the task you have set before us. We will complete the task in Jesus' name. And we will walk away. And we will leave the mysteries of God in the hands of the earth for the world to read. My child, I am so proud of you both. You have worked so hard. No one will ever understand how hard it was to write the mysteries of God. Two short years, my children. Two short years, and you wrote every single word. 2.2 million words for me. I know how hard this was for you. For you both had young children. And you were both so obedient. And you finished the task. And now the task is being seen by the world. My words are going forth. And people are falling to their knees in worship. Being consumed by my love and presence and glory. For in these words is my presence, my love, my peace, freedom in Christ. My child, your words, hala hala hashiki, that you are speaking now, are not your words, they are mine. They are living and active, sharper than a double-edged sword. And the mysteries of God, the words that you released, they are my words. And they are being released in spirit and truth across the world at this time. Those who are hungry, those who thirst after my ways, after my mysteries, will read it. Do not worry, my child. If it looks like no one cares, if no one cares to read my book, Father God, it feels like no one cares. It really does. We have done everything to let people know about your words, your words that are being released at this time. We pray that you bring people to read your words. Help us not to fail you in this task, Father, of getting these words into the nation. I pray for a team, a team of people that will help us to release these words to the nations. I pray for those who care, those who want to read your words, those who want to see your books go forth across the land. I pray that you bring unto us people who are willing, who are obedient, who are dedicated and faithful to help these words. Your books go to the nations. Bring them to us, Lord, and we promise to love them, to care for them. We would be so thankful for help at this time so that we can stand before you night and day, so that we can release these words to the nations, these messages. My child, I promise to bring you help in the days to come. I promise to open eyes to see, hearts to know and understand, and ears to hear. I promise to bring you people predestined to help you. I will place upon them a desire to help you, to help carry the books to the nations, to help to spread these messages throughout the land. I will place upon them a strong desire to help me to build the kingdom, to release the promised mysteries of God. I am with you, my child, and I know how tiring this journey can be. My children on the earth, please, Krahashiki, I am calling you now. Kalaharabasitiki, those who are listening to these words. I am asking you to help these maidservants to share these words with the nations. Come to me this day, pray unto me, and I will speak unto you one on one, my child. I am calling out to my children on the earth to help me to release my mysteries across the land, to your friends, to your family, to your nations. 
I will give you creative ideas, creative ways to share my words. Thank you, my children, for listening unto me now. This is the word of the Lord your God, who lives and abides forever. Amen.